Hello, welcome back my crafty friends. How's everybody doing today? Well, I have a share from the church thrift store that I fancy. And uh, I got quite a bit of stuff. So first we have this Spanish Dutch dictionary. I'm a sucker for dictionary and for other languages. And I have a bunch of German stuff. So it's nice to have what I'm assuming is Dutch. Let me put it that way. I'm assuming that's Dutch. Danish. Dutch. I don't know. But it, I know it's not German, right? Ooh, somebody needs to correct me. I don't know. And then I got this tracing. All of this seems like deja vu. I didn't show this stuff already to you, did I? Usually I put it away when I do. So I got tracing paper, but it seems like I've shown you this. Well, yesterday I picked up a bunch of stuff that I'm fixing to show you that I know I didn't show you. And then we have graph paper. I couldn't think of what it was called. And this from 1963, this record book, which has some pages written in it and some blank pages. So pretty cool. And then look at this. Is this not cute? This is just little itty bitty squares. I don't want to take it out, but of all different B. I want to show you, but I don't want to take it out. Let me see. How's that? All different B material. Little itty bitty. Look at the honeycomb. That is so cute. The honeycomb with the B. Be caring, be you, be happy, be true. Isn't this cool? I got this for a dollar. And I love it. B journal. Definitely needs to be in the works. Oh no, I can't get it. It's going to fall off. And then this... This goes around a boutique, but, you know, of flowers that you carry, like when you're getting married, very pretty. But um, these are all separate beads, so I got it for 50 cents, and that many pearls is definitely worth 50 cents. And then I found some Elmer's glue for just a dollar, which is awesome for um the faux rice paper that I do with napkins if you haven't seen that video go check it out yeah I know I haven't shown you any of this stuff because I always take the price tag off this I got for two bucks it's just my color always need a basket and then this one isn't this pretty? It's going to go awesome in my craft room. This was $4, but I think it was half price. Blue was half price that day. Very nice. So yesterday, I went to a yard sale, which is where I got this gorgeousness from. And this is a large curtain shear that has all this pretty lace. And it is already coffee dyed <laughs> it's the color of it see the flowers in it it's gorgeous i got that for a dollar i got that at a yard sale and this for a dollar i love these squares that they can be cut off and then you pockets i see a bunch of pockets and then at the thrift store is where I got the rest. Of, oh, wait. One more thing from that yard sale. 
I don't need this, but it was a dollar and I thought I might need this. I often take fussy cutting to the couch at night with my husband. And so this might come in handy for that. Or I might need it in my craft room once we move. So I thought that was a pretty neat find for a dollar. Almost didn't get it, but then I decided to. Okay, now we're on to the church thrift store that I go to. I got this for $1.75. It is a pinkish red. It's like really hard for me to tell if it's red or pink. So it's a pinkish red and the hem looks more red but it still has a lot of pink in it and they had a lot of seam binding and i couldn't find any that matched none of the red matched none of the pink matched so i got all this seam binding for 10 cents All of that, 10 cents each. So we have some lace seam binding. It's all lace seam binding. It's just white, different colors. White, brown, pink, navy, black lace. I don't know what color you call that, but it's, it's an off-white, like alabaster or almond or something. Oh, beige says beige right on it. Peach. Toast. And a pink. Another navy. This one's wide. So some of it's wide like this. This one's wide. Oh, I got two of those. Yep. Exact same thing. But that is okay because it was 10 cents. A black thin one and a white lace wide one. And then this, let's open this up and look at this. Oh, I make it so hard. I got this for a dollar. One and a half yards. And it's some pretty trim. I like that. That's the back side. It's got the little brown beads, so it's definitely vintage. Would go with any vintage journal. So cool. And then this for $1.75. And I thought this was a pretty color. Very pretty. There's a lot there. Definitely a few yards. And look what I found for 50 cents. I've been wanting to try them. And I checked it. It's still good. So now I can try it and see how it works. I get these little itty bitty baby bells for 10 cents. These are going to be cute on um, dangling from your uh, wax thread from when you bind your journal. And then more wallpaper. I seem to find wallpaper every time I go out. So let's see what this looks like. We can get into it. Oh my goodness. Why did they have it wrapped like that and then taped? Vintage tape. How cool is that? I 
That's so pretty with the blue roses. So that's second time in a row I found something with roses. Very pretty. And then a bunch of doilies. I got two different sizes two different sizes in here and then a whole bunch in here I wonder if that can fit in there bunch of different patterns here's some hearts I like this. This is going to be awesome in a journal. And it has little roses on it. Some bigger hearts. And then one of these, which again would be perfect in a journal. That's perfect page size. And as soon as I move, I'm going to do a treatment on some of these doilies with my beeswax. So stay tuned for that. Let's see what else we got down here. Oh, I swear, it seems like I showed you these flowers too. I think I showed you these. But I'll go through just in case. Some pretty roses. I don't know why I wouldn't have put it away if I showed it to you, though. Very pretty ribbon. Yeah, this seems like deja vu. <laughs> Here again, some pink ribbon. This will make nice bows, too. Now I can't get it back. Ugh. Some lace. Pretty off-white color. A doily. Trying to figure out which side is which. This side, I guess. With roses. And then a pillowcase. That's going to be great for tassels. Nice vintage tablecloth. So that's it for my share with you guys today. A lot of stuff, but it goes fast. But I appreciate you guys being here. I got some string too. And checking out what I have this week. And I hope to see you next week. Thanks guys. Bye.